Hello and welcome to the family entertainment edition of Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? I'm sure you're keen to get into that hot seat, so let's get started. OK, let's take a quick check on the rules. Up to four of you can play the game and each of you will need to choose adult or junior questions. Then, for the first time ever, you'll be able to choose the type of questions you'd like to answer. There are three categories. General knowledge, entertainment and sport. Simply choose one and stick with it. All you need to do then is answer the 15 questions that stand between you and a virtual one million pounds. As always, you can walk away at any time and there are the usual three lifelines available to you. Ask the audience, 50-50 and phone a friend. If you make it all the way to a million, you could be jetting off on a luxurious family holiday by entering our competition. So grab your remote control and let's play Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Select the difficulty and category of questions you'd like to play. Great, you're having a go at the entertainment questions. Fifteen of them stand between you and a virtual million pounds. The first five of those questions can bank you a guaranteed thousand pounds. Right, here's your first question for one hundred pounds. That's right, a nice way to start. £200 if you can get this right. Well done, you just won £200. Now, you've not used any lifelines, so they are still all available if you need them on this £300 question. You're right, well done. Question number four is for 500 quid. Very well played, that's the right answer. This is the last chance that you could leave us with absolutely nothing. Please don't do that. Here comes question number five. well done, that's the right answer for £1,000. That's what I like to see, five correct answers and £1,000 safely in the bank. This is where things hot up a little bit though, as we try and turn that £1,000 into at least £32,000. Here comes question number six. Now remember, you still have all three lifelines remaining. Just won £2,000. It was the right answer. Very well done. You've yet to touch any of your three lifelines and a correct answer here will win you £4,000. Lots of luck. Here comes the question. A correct answer here is worth £4,000. And that's exactly what you have given me. It's the right answer. Oh, I like games like this. You're on £4,000 and you have all three of your lifelines still intact. You are just three questions away from the next milestone. And the first of those questions is worth £8,000 and is coming up now. Aha! Audience, time for you to get involved and help win us a bit of cash. Have a look at the question and vote A, B, C or D on your keypads. All vote now. As audience help goes, I said that, that was pretty good. Now, are you going to go for C? Very well done. That's the right answer and it's worth £8,000. 
You're just two correct answers away now from guaranteeing yourself £32,000. The first of those two questions is worth £16,000. Now, you do not have to play this if you don't want to, but you do have a 50-50 and a phone a friend available to help you find that correct answer. Best of luck. Here it comes. You had £8,000. You've just doubled it to £16,000. Well done. Right, this is a very serious moment. You have £16,000. If you do get the next question right, you'll definitely be leaving with no less than £32,000. Give me a wrong answer, though, and you have to take a drop of 15000 Not good. I really do wish you the very best of luck. Here comes question number 10. Are you sure you want to risk all that money? OK, I won't keep you in suspense. It's the right answer. You just won £32,000. Right, you can relax a bit now, mainly because you cannot lose anything by giving me the wrong answer to the next question. If you give me a correct answer, I'll double your £32,000 to £64,000. And if you don't know the answer, you still have a 50-50 available, or you can phone one of your friends for a bit of help. The very best of luck. Here comes question number 11 of a possible 15. Okay, let's see if going 50-50 will help. The computer is going to take away two wrong answers and leave you with just the two to choose from. Well, you only had two answers to choose from and you chose the right one. You won £64,000. Right, things are going really well. Amazing how quickly you can turn 32,000 into 64. But let's just calm down a bit. The next question is worth £125,000. A huge amount of money. You do not have to play this question. But you've still got a phone a friend lifeline available should you need it. Here we go. The very best of luck. Well, there's no going back from this point. You've given me your final answer. I'm ripping up your virtual check for £64,000 and replacing it with one for £125,000. It's the right answer. Did you really think when you started out that you get to the point where I would be asking you a question for £250,000? Probably not, but it is about to happen. Please, please do not give me a wrong answer and phone a friend if you aren't totally sure of your answer. Let's see what happens as we look at question number 12. Well, I don't blame you for using a lifeline if you're not sure. Pick one of your friends and we'll give them a call. Let me think. Um, I'm going to have to guess at D. If I were you, I'd say D. Sorry, I can't be any more help. So they're making a guess at D. Now, sometimes it's better if they don't make a guess at all. You do not have to take any notice. You can still make a guess of your very own.
You could be about to become a quarter of a millionaire, or of course you could be about to lose £93,000. You've just given me the right answer. Terrific, you could now go all the way. Wow, this is a superb performance. I've just written you out a virtual check for £250,000. Now, hopefully, you can go further. I'm about to ask you a question worth half a million pounds. 500000 Remember, you have used up all your lifelines, so it would be a serious risk to just guess at this stage, as you would lose £218,000. Have a look at the question. It's number 14 of a possible 15. I must say, I love it when people play these big questions. You had £250,000. You now have £500,000. Fantastic! Right, here we go then. This is your one and perhaps only ever chance to win one million pounds. You have no lifelines left, so you are either going to have to make a complete guess or, of course, you may well just know the answer. I should remind you of the massive amount of money you could lose, but think of what you could win. The best of luck, everybody here is rooting for you. The Australian soap Neighbours celebrated which anniversary in 2005? 15th, 20th, 25th, 30th. And I have to check that you are really going to play this question. Is this your final answer? Amazingly, you've decided to play the million pound question. Now, you could have walked away with half a million pounds, but instead, you are walking away with one million pounds. You're a winner. Fantastically well done. Not only have you won a million, you've also got the chance to enter a draw to win a fantastic, all expenses paid family holiday. Just text the winning code to the number on your screen. Very well done, and thanks for playing the family entertainment edition of Who Wants to Be a Millionaire?